then you ever did this to your coach? You win, right? You ever get a, a the cooler and dump it on your coach? <laughs> yeah, after we won the Super Bowls, we would we would take the big cooler and dump it on them. I tried that one day, my coach. She told me I better not do that. <laughs> My name is Corey Williams. I live in Chicago, Illinois. I play Special Olympic basketball, football, softball, and and I really coach high school football and basketball. Hey, I'm I'm Dan Klecko. I've uh, been with Arthur J. Gallagher for about six years now. I played in the National Football League for eight years, and I was very fortunate to win uh, three Super Bowls. And I'm, I'm super excited to be talking to Corey today and talking about football. So who was the special coach that helped you when you when you got into Special Olympics? I got two favorite coaches. One of the name is Coach Katie and the other name is G. They they helped me a lot to get in this sports. So how did they help you? What did, what did they help you with? They helped me to get better, put me in shape, and be a good leader. So the Special Olympics has meant a lot to you, huh? It's, it means a lot to me. It's good to me. They, they taught me a lot of things. They taught me about basketball, how to, how to change my attitude. No, I didn't know nothing about special when I, when I joined that. When I got in, I, I wasn't in shape. So they helped you with everything, not just football, huh? They everything to me. They taught me how to play football, softball, basketball, soccer. They taught me a lot of, a lot of stuff. Think back then, I'm gonna tell you about it. I never want to be a quarterback. She taught me a lot of things. Say, hey, you can do this. I want you to be the quarterback. I see something in you. So when I've been a quarterback, and I told her I liked it. So ever since that moment, she, she saw something in you that you didn't even know you had in you, huh? Yeah. So my favorite coach was a guy in high school named Coach Zadilla. When I was a sophomore, I was, I was very nervous. I moved to a new high school. I didn't know how good everyone was. And he really gave me my first chance to play and start with the big guys. It's just like you love your coaches there at the Special Olympics. He was my favorite. We still talk to this day. When you play football, you play NFL, what do you think about the whole culture style? Right, so when you're in the NFL especially, you're just the guy that, that, that they can replace. So, you know, your coaching staff's tough on you, they're hard on you, they expect a lot of things out of you, and, and you have to turn around and, and do the things they expect. There's 52 other guys on that team, you can't let them down. Hey, Corey, I got another question for you. What do you teach your guys about life now? Respect, man, it's like, you want respect, show respect. You know, it's like teach them how to do the right thing and don't hang out street. Go home, do your homework, and get up for the next day and let's go work out. And I'm just waiting to meet you in person and know we can you can teach me and I'll teach you. Oh, you're gonna teach me, yeah. You know, you already know all my tricks. <laughs>